now moving on to the second section uh, multiple correct type the first question is uh, to check the principle of multiple proportions a series of pure binary compounds uh, were analyzed and their composition is uh, tabulated below the correct options is are so basically there are three compounds all containing p and q having different weight ratio of uh, p and q so we have to find out which options is are correct for uh, these compounds the first option is if empirical formula of compound 3 is p3q4 then the empirical formula of compound 2 is p3q5 so for the third compound the weight ratio of p is 40 and the weight ratio of uh, q is 60 so if uh, i find uh, the number of moles they have given the empirical formula to be p3q4 which means number of moles of p upon number of moles of q is 3 upon 4 and that should be equal to weight upon molecular weight uh, of p which is uh, 40 upon molecular weight of p divided by uh, 60 upon molecular weight of uh, atomic weight of q so that is uh, 2 upon 3 into q upon p so this implies q upon p is equal to uh, 9 by 8 so for the th second compound the weight ratio is uh, 40 uh, 40 uh, weight percent is 44.4 and 55.6 so if i find for the second compound then uh, it would be it would be uh, number of moles of p upon number of moles of q would be 44.4 upon 55.6 into q upon p q upon p is 9 by 8 and this is this value is uh, approximately 0 0.8 9 upon 8 so this ratio of p and q in the second compound uh, comes out to be uh, 9 by 10 so the correct formula for the second compound will be p 9 q 10 and they have given p 3 q 5 this is definitely not correct so option a is not correct second option if empirical formula of compound 3 is p 3 q 2 the atomic weight of element p is 20 uh, then the atomic weight of element q is 45 now uh, number of moles of p upon q for the third compound is given as 3 upon 2 which is uh, 40 upon p 60 upon q that is 2 upon 3 into q upon p so this implies q by p is 9 by 4 uh, they have given the atomic weight of p is 20 so if the atomic weight of p is kept 20 then the atomic weight of q comes out to be 9 by 4 into 20 that is uh, 9 into 5 that is 45 so which means option b is correct statement option c if empirical formula of compound 2 is pq for the second compound the ratio of number of moles of p and q is given as 1 is to 1 which is equal to 44.4 that is 0 0.8 times q upon p uh, then the empirical formula of compound 1 would be p 5 q 4 so for the first compound uh, n upon p upon n upon uh, n of p upon n, uh, n of q is uh, 50 upon atomic weight of p upon 50 upon 50 atomic weight of q that is q upon p so it is 1 into atom uh, q upon p is uh, 10 by uh, 10 by 8 right which is 5 by 4 so the correct formula of the compound would be p 5 q 4 p 5 q 4 and that is what they have given which makes option c also correct 
that is check option D if atomic weight of P and Q are 70 and 35 respectively then the empirical formula of 1 is P to Q for first compound NP upon NQ would be 50 upon P that is 1 into Q upon P Q value they have given as uh, 35 and P value they have given as 70 so it is 1 upon 2 so the formula would be P Q 2 not P 2 Q so this option is wrong so the correct answer for the ninth question would be B and C